Hello everyone and welcome to this short tutorial on running your PHP script using console. Actually you get your PHP console with your PHP setup. Uh, the php.exe it resides in your PHP folder. Um, I got WAMP installed in my computer so I have my PHP installed via WAMP. So I have to to find the php.exe I have to go to where I have installed WAMP. Here I have installed WAMP. So I go to WAMP bin php php 5.5.12 and here it is the php.exe. Okay. So first of all you have to add this directory where your php.exe resides to the environment variables. To do this copy the directory and then you can open the advanced system settings window uh, one way is to click on your my computer go to properties then from the left hand side menu click on advanced system settings and you are here but if you are unable to find your my computer anyway you can simply press your Windows key plus R to bring up the run window and then type control sysdm.cpl press enter this will bring the system properties now go to the advanced tab anyway you are here so you now have to go to the environment variables then in the system variables find the variable path double click to open it and at the end of it put a semicolon and then paste your directory of the php.exe folder you just copied it now just paste it here and after this just keep pressing ok 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 to get rid of the windows okay so now you actually have it um, I will be creating my script uh, directly in the root of the windows system drive C drive so okay so here we have uh, our PHP script. We will write echo 5 plus 10. We obviously know that this script, if it is running, it should output 15. Now let's check if it is outputting 15. Now we are going to open our CMD. Here we will write php.exd and the location of our script, which is c colon backslash index.php. Now we press enter and we have our output. So that's how we can um, run PHP scripts through console. Okay, but this is uh, a bit tedious to do this always. I mean, opening up your CMD, then type php.exe, then the location of the script, which can be very long because in for just for test purpose, I am writing my script in C drive uh, but it's not the case always I have different locations in my computer categorized folder right you maybe you also have I, I, I think so how about a way to double click and run the script like uh, other dot exe uh, dot exe uh, things you make with C or C++ well there's a way Okay, to do this, uh, right click on somewhere you can create a text document. Now name it something. I am naming run, but the extent extension must be dot bat, which stands for batch. So what we are doing is we are creating a batch file. Then you open it with notepad and write php dot exe index dot php. Then pause. Save it. Now I have to take this run.bat to the location where I have my index of PHP. So I paste it in my C drive. Okay. So now you see the bat file is accompanying the PHP file, but I will be clicking on the bat file, double click, and it's running, executing. So that's it. But if you, you see, there's a lot of strings which are not necessary as the output of our program. So we have to edit the batch file a bit more to 
get a clearer screen by echo off and then get a new line by echo dot okay I cannot save these files in my pdrive directly uh, save okay I go and edit the one I have in desktop so I echo off echo dot save it copy Now if I run it, I see 15, press negative continue to exit of the con exit the console. So that's how you run your PHP scripts through console. I hope you liked it and I hope it helped you. Thank you very much.